Okay, good evening everybody. As promised, we are live from a destination which has got a bed bug problem. So, this is the bedroom that's actually had the bed bugs. Uh, I'd just like to introduce my colleague Peter tonight, who's helping me out. Good evening, Peter. Good evening. Do you want to introduce your company? Hello, my name's Peter. I'm with Integrum Services, out uh, tonight helping Mark with his very special project, 135 flats, six floors, we've tracked it back, this flat here is the cause of the infestation throughout the building. So just to confirm, this flat has had bed bugs for how many years? Six years. Six years. Six years, last night they were sleeping in this bed. So the bed that we're about to show, the owners were sleeping in this bed. Yeah they are, and it takes, it's pretty bad in it, it takes a lot for me to wear coveralls when I'm doing a bed bug. Yeah, well, I must say, you're looking pretty smart. Thank why you, so are you, Mark. Why don't we give the viewers a little bit of a, an insight? Why right, don't we... Let, let's start with a smaller one, shall we, Mark? Yeah, let's start, let's, let's build up to it. Just here on the wall. So if we look at the wall here, people, those little cracks in the wall are packed with bed bugs. With bed bugs. Uh, and here they come. So they're starting to come out now. I'll just get a little bit closer, if I may. And here they are, coming out of the walls. So what we're going to do shortly is, just to bear in mind everyone, that absolutely everything in this property is going to be removed. It's all going to be wrapped, and it's going to be removed. So when we start applying the insecticide, for those of you that feel that we're um, contravening kosh, we're not, because everything is being soaked tonight, and everything will be removed in a few days' time. So if you just... Let's give the viewers a little bit more to look at, Peter. If we just lift up the oh, side of this bed. You're very welcome. So, in this particular flat, the main infestation is actually on the bed. Can you get your light on? Mark? Yeah, I'm just trying to get my light on. It won't go on. Turn it on. Unable to turn on. Ooh. So, you're going to have to bear with us on the light, people. So... This is just looking at one corner of the... Yeah, uh, and we see all those bugs running around. ...of the throw on the bed. So we haven't even reached the bed yet. This is just a throw. You see all those nymphs running around? So the plan's going to be that we're going to wrap and seal the bed and the mattress... So all in one. All in one. So therefore we are literally... Going to encapsulate it all. Yeah, absolutely. But here we go on to the second sheet. So this is the second sheet. And again, we haven't even met, reached the mattress yet. And you can see all this fecal. You might want to brace yourselves, people, honestly. You're not ever going to see anything like this on the pest control group in your life. So this is a live feed from a six-year bed bug infestation. And one quarter of the bed. If we just open it up a little bit more, Peter. This is just one corner of the second sheet down. Wow, up to six viewers now. Get sharing, people. Wow. I mean, this is what we're up against. These, these poor residents in the building have been affected by this. And again, just to reiterate, this is one section of the bed. I mean, if we just look... We ain't even worked up a quarter of this bed yet. Excuse my nose. So again, I mean, just zooming in there for people to see. For those of you who are just joining, this is a live, live stream for a six-year bed bug infestation. And we've, uh, tonight we're going to be wrapping as much as we can, which will mean encapsulating the bed within cling film. And that will be ready for safe removal tomorrow by our removal team. I mean, if we just look at the, the, the actual mattress. I say it's a mattress. It's not much of a mattress. But it's just absolutely covered in faecal. There's every life cycle that you can imagine here. So we're going to get to work. I mean, we're probably into the tens of thousands of insects. As many as that, Peter, yes? Yeah, well, as we get further down... I mean, yeah, let's, bearing in mind, people, let's just go over to the other side of the bed. 
I think what we should really do is we actually lift up this throw, Peter, and we'll give people the real treat as to what we're dealing with here. I mean, that's just mass blood. Absolute mass blood there. I mean, we're up to ten, up to ten followers now. Keep sharing, people. Really appreciate the support tonight. Just to give you all a bit of a recap, we're live at a six-year bedbug infestation in a property. As you can see, this is really well established. I mean, just let's have a look at the base of that fan. I mean, this is a fan. Bearing in mind, people, you just bring that a little bit closer to the camera, Peter. You just see all that fecal. See bed bugs everywhere. And everywhere you go, there's just bed bugs. So, this is all going to be dealt with tonight. So, we're going to take a short break, people, and get the bed wrapped and then start. Yeah, Mark, oh, there. before we have, have a look. look at that. <laughs> so, as most of you know, when you've got the bed bugs out, like this, just set out on top of the bed. I mean, all the prime harbourage, all the creases are just so packed with bed bugs. There is literally, they're just having to sit out in the open. Because it's that packed with bed bugs. Because it's that packed. I mean, ooh. I haven't looked at this top corner, but again, this is just the top throw. You really can see. Just how bad it is. Wow, you can see that just running alive there. It's just as we're disturbing them. So do get sharing, people, for all you bed bug lovers out there. How's that for some eggs? A few eggs. If anyone needs any bed bug eggs, do get in touch. We're doing special deals. But I mean, you know, let's put this into contents. This is actually where someone's living, so. This is actually what we're up against. We're up to 11 followers now, so... And this is the bed that they sleep in every night, two of them. So these are feeding on two people. This isn't special effects, guys, I can assure you, and girls. This is as it stands, as it, as it sits. I mean, this is the severity, the infestation. Just show me your, your hand, Peter. I mean, that, that's the level of activity in here. We're actually having to duct tape our feet our hands. If you turn round, they're up in the corners of each room. Yeah, in the far corner there, they're up. Up there, you can see that one there, I'm reluctant to get up on the bed, but the second patch in from the left, yeah. that's literally a bulge in the ceiling. Yeah, <coughs> where there's bed where they living in there. around it to try and provide them just a little bit of harbourage. And the problem that we've... Shit. <laughs> <laughs> the problem that we've, uh, we're facing here is the residents that are in here walk the building on a daily basis, all six floors. They visit other flats. Um, what we've done, when we've looked at the infestation profile of this building, we've seen that uh, the gentleman and his wife that live in this flat have visited multiple flats all across the building, and now those flats have... <laughs> we're insured. <laughs> Um, all the flats that they visited are now infested. I mean, you can see by the numbers. Yeah, I mean, with that are in here, quite clearly, this chap is walking around. So, how, as a rough estimate, how many bugs would you say uh, are oh, here, Peter? We're into thousands, absolute thousands. And the other thing to remember is the flats either side of this property they are pouring through the water. Well, how many have we treated so far? Thirteen. Yeah. 13 flats and counting at the moment. 13 flats and counting in the building. Come and have a look at this here, Mark, before we have a, a little break and wrap this up before yep. they're still encapsulated. So, this is probably the worst that you're going to see tonight, people. We're going to wrap this bed after, and this is going to be ready for removal. But we'll just give you, again, just, just to give you an idea as to what we're up against. You have to get sharing, people, because you're never going to see bed bugs like this. I'll... I can be assured. I mean, look, they're just running alive. I mean, this is a live issue. This is where someone is sleeping. This is where someone was asleep last night. And they're only not sleeping here tonight because we've evicted them for their own safety. 
I mean, we do appreciate everyone's support on this. Get sharing, people. We want to get the numbers up. 13 is great. But we just want to raise the awareness as to how bad these things can get. And this is London. We're in London. Where all the good things happen. We're going to wrap this in a minute, but I'm just going to lick you. Have a quick... <laughs> I, is I it, even is it, is this it running corner. alive? Have a look at this corner under here, and then we, we need to get wrapping this. Right, so... This is on a bin bag they put down a few days ago. Yeah. Look at that. I mean, look, guys. Look, guys. You know, I, we kid you not. This this is by far. I mean, Peter's. For those of you that know Peter, how long have you been dealing with bed bugs for, Peter? Quite a while. <laughs> and this quite. is this is quite significant. I mean, look at that plug socket. Yeah, this is this is probably one of the worst that I've seen, and it's really good for the weird people like us that like bugs. It's really oh, good course. to be working with uh, Mark and Porters on this project. Well, it, it just it's an eye opener, really, that. You know, if if you really do leave things untreated, how how out of control it can become. At the moment, we're looking probably twenty percent of this building is infested from this. Ah, I've just got managed to get some light on. So apologies for the bad lighting, people, but we've just got the light going now. So we'll just get in on all this. I mean, look at the light. Oh, Peter, look at it over here. Look. They're literally just falling off the beds now, look. Right, I think uh, if we take a little break, we get the bed wrapped up, or at least the mattress and the top cover in and start doing something with the bottom now. Yep, well thanks for following everyone. We're going to have a short break, but do do stay tuned. We will be coming back. Thank you.